I don't even have to agree. That's right. not the point. The point exactly. is not, you know, I have to figure out a rebuttal, you know, in terms of active listening or anything like that. I don't have to be right. <gasps> what? I don't have to be right. Well, hold on a second. Oh, Let's oh, pump oh. the brakes on that, Daryl. Like, what are you going to just expose your belly and just let people walk all over you? No, that's not it at all. And selfishly, if I know my enemy really well, then I can figure out how to influence them. And, and that's a, an extreme example. But I think that that's such a, an important phrase, integrate into understanding. And, and it's a deliberate step, which I really, really liked about that. Thank you for bringing up all the, the importance of curiosity. And, and everybody has a story to tell. And it's not in a bad way. Like everybody just has a story. We all have our experiences. And somebody that looks just like you um, might have had a very different experience. And they have their own story to share. So taking the time to honor that and listen to them and hear their story, like you're, you're just going to learn so much about humanity, about them, about yourself. And you're going to learn how to interact with that person in a way that's going to be a lot more effective. We'll also recognize biases. You know, again, we, we don't have four hours to talk about subconscious or unconscious biases, but um, I was recently on a, on a large project for a non-governmental agency here in Canada, and mm. we had 500 people that I was leading and supporting. And most or a lot were new Canadians, literally new Canadians, refugees from different countries and, and so on and so forth. Mm. And it was really interesting, like legit interesting, Rob, just to hear their stories and absolutely amazing, amazing people, amazing individuals. But even if I wasn't looking to integrate in, in understanding, um, if, if I wasn't interested in that, then I would miss out on the fact that people are freaking amazing. I've, you know, people, everyone has a story to tell and I'm coming at it as a white male, 49 years old, handsome, smart, intelligent, charismatic. Okay. Maybe my self-awareness is a little yeah, bit off, <laughs> but let's move on, shall we? Um, but yeah, you know, and, and part of leadership is about being curious because you could miss something too. If you think that you have all the answers, well, you don't have all the answers and that's a red flag. So even integrating it to understanding allows you to make better judgment calls, which you talked about a bit earlier, and you can gain through other people's experiences too. So that can yeah. enrich your own life and your own career as well. So I think that's really, really important. 